And this is the Darren Howell Stayers. And first up we have Song of Summer, Tamino, Frosty Feluga, Put Modern, Rum C, then Candy Floss, Dieppe, Capdor Silver. Capdor Silver. Okay, so eight of them then this time, over two miles and five furlongs. No, two miles and two furlongs, just two and a quarter miles. The Darren Howell Stairs, can he win his own race? He's got Frosty Voluga to give him a chance, they're away and racing. And Put Modern on the inside is the first one to show. From Rumsey, and Dieppe in the blue. They get name checks in for all these quite a few times in this. As it's a fairly small field and a long way to go, but Dieppe's the leader. This is my first race of the week on grass. It's nice to be on grass. Dieppe's the leader from Put Modern, Capdoor Silver and Rumsey, virtually three in a line. And a gap of about six or seven lengths to Tamino in the yellow, but it's almost four in a line at the back as well with Frosty the Luga, Song of Summer and Candy Floss. So almost formation racing then with the front four, seven lengths clear of the back four. And Dieppe in front by about a neck to Rumsey and Capdoor Silver, the two Doug Warren horses. Since to be named in this race, but well done. And uh, then Put Modern is fourth, a gap of about seven. Then to Song of Summer and Frosty Valuga for Darren House trying to win his own race. Then Tamino in the yellow and Candy Floss in the green on the outside. So, not much happening really at the moment. All is pretty much static. Still got a mile and a half to go. A oh, mile and five furlongs still to go. And uh, Dieppe leads by a head to Rumsey in second. Capdoor Silver on the outside is just third. Put Modern on the rail is fourth. Gap of six or seven. Two Song of Summer in the purple and heads of the chasing pack. And then three in a line from the inside. Frosty Voluga, Tamino and Candy Floss. A little change in the order throughout this race then. The chasing pack are getting a little bit closer. Dieppe is just in front. C second, Port Modern third, and Capital Silver fourth. Chasing Pack again a little bit closer now, they're probably only four or five lengths behind. They're still headed by Song of Summer, Frosty Voluga, Tamino, and Candy Floss. On the back three. As they race downhill now, then. And Dieppe and Rumsey disputing the lead with the back four, and now within four lengths. Field should merge into one shortly as they approach the mile point. Dieppe. On the outside, trying to give James Follis a quick double. Romsey on the inside, the dog. And Capdoor Silver on the outside. Port Modern is next. It's a little gap of no more than a couple of lengths now to Song of Summer and Candy Floss chasing that one. And then the back two are Tamino and Frosty Voluga for the sponsor at the back. But it's Dieppe in the lead. By neck half a length now. Pushing on to three quarters of a length. Coming to the final six furlongs. Dieppe in the blue from Rumsey and Capdoor Silver. And Put Modern. Song of Summer and Candy Floss trying to get closer. And Frosty Voluga is going to have to pull out, I think. And Tamino. Probably going to try and come widest of all at the back. And they're almost racing Indian file now. That's Dieppe the leader. From the Warren Pair second and third, Rumsey and Capdoor Silver. Candy Floss is the one who looks like he's going to be the first of the back four group to break into the front four group as Put Modern now looks to be struggling for room. Song of Summer's coming around the outside nicely. Frosty Voluga's also trying to make a run, but Dieppe suddenly shot four clear. It's Dieppe in the lead then by about four to Rumsey in second. Then Song of Summer in the purple on the outside is third. Then comes Capdoor Silver. Candy Floss is next. Then Frosty Voluga, then Put Modern Tomino. Put Modern looks to be the only one really beaten, but it's Dieppe they've got to get to into the final third and a half. And Dieppe is four clear, and I can't see them closing this gap. It's Dieppe well clear. But Song of Summer's trying to tr close. So too is Candy Floss and Rumsey, but they're not going to get to this. Dieppe, I don't think Dieppe's in the lead. Jock has a little look round, he's beginning to toll up. Song of Summer's beginning to quicken. It's Dieppe in the lead. Song of Summer's trying to close. They're racing into the final half. Well, Song of Summer is now lunging towards the line. Dieppe needs the line to come. Here comes Song of Summer on the outside, and so too did Tamino from nowhere. That was mighty close in the end. I think Tamino won that. Goodness me. Tamino crept up from nowhere. This is going to be on the nod. It's Tamino. 
Might be a dead heat still, of course, but I don't think so. No, Tamino wins it by a short head for Obi Wan. Dieppe second for James Follis by another short head. And Song of Summer for Martin Little further, another short head. And Frosty Valunga for Darren Howes by another short head. Candy Floss for Kevin Minahan was fifth. So what an exciting finish that was.